We'll finish off with Dennis Goodnight and JW finding a kill on Smith brings this back in the favor of Fnatic. Good nade, but it won't do the damage on to Venton, who's low. That certainly will, though. A scream finding a better position behind the HPC finds Flush as well. Follows up and down goes JW. He may get the fourth pistol. Not quite gonna land as Dennis slips away. Come back in as well. He's gonna commit to this this round surely, and there it is. Scream to close it. Brilliantly done from him. Four kills. The time is running low. 30 seconds, Dennis moving forwards now. Great first kill, that was so quick. And the second one. Dennis is going absolutely ham there with those two frags and now looking to get the third one in similar fashion. And he will, exactly as the first two arrive. Dennis delivers a third kill. And uh, Pit is waiting patiently behind the smoke. However, Forrest isolated and alone gets killed, but the flash in for Pit. He's going to take a quick frag to the damage. Another one, a third from Pit. Great stuff there, pushing forwards with that flashbang. Another shot connected. Great stuff from Cajun B, leaving things in a three versus one. Kenny is now the man who has to stop this, but the shenanigans are still on here from the Dignitas side, despite being down to two players. So, so Kenny going for the bad plants. Basically, that's one of the hardest plants to defend for AP. Just looking for players here. I think he tagged both of them with one shot. He did. Config's got eight HP. Next hit wins, perhaps, if Config can find the head with the AK. Kenny S with a purely absurd shot to finish things off. Although eventually there is a, a trade for Scream, but still it's a bit awkward. Get right finally will get another trade going in for his team. Oh, that pop mid air from Get right the dink as well to follow. And now Scream is dead. Absolutely, someone just can't do anything about these deagles. And there we go, more deagle action coming in from MSL. Two versus three now. Just down to Kenny S with the Mag 10. And this is going to be tough. Here he goes, though. And he's got a nade that could be solid there on the APC, but just missing Cajun B. He's going to go for the frag here. This is smart with the Mag 10. He's going to bring the fight to them, to the close ranges. And this is exactly what he needs to do. And here he goes with that Mag 10, just running all over the place in pursuit of these players. He's going to pick up all five kills. Body's going to wait. That's a good position. That's easily done. Thank you very, very much. Oh, whatever. Swap for the pistol. Go for the ace. He's got it. He's got all five. You I'll get you next time. You couldn't shut me out. You couldn't do it. You're too strong. Apparently. Shock's going to take down Taz. He's got the entrance toward the... Oh, this is perfect. Defense as well. The Molotov goes out. He just has to hold the off angle. He's going to go above He's that. He's enjoying himself now, isn't he? What? what? It's the shot on past that truck. Like, how crisp are their shots right now? <laughs> Looks good for Astralis, but they are all getting taken down now. Only two players, but they have such good positions, but they're all for nothing at the moment. Two man spray down for Kyabi though. But the bomb still needs to be retrieved by one of these two players. Kyabi just showing his worth here. Two to two now. Oh, Kyabi might have a free kill there, but he's going to be careful not to be too obsessed with this player. He, oh, he might get shot in the back, but he's going to have the cognizance to check his back. Get the frag. Both kills, in fact. And a third is on the way. That is the AWP down, and the round shut down by Kyabi. Thankfully, it's already been cleared off. Ooh. Night what? what is that, Shox? Two huge kills. Dennis uh. goes down, Crims follows up, and Shox is absolutely on fire. Look at that shot as well. Venton's gone. Position in one he has to make up for, but he goes down. And now, Flush at least knows they're going to push on to Long. Does find one shot immediately into body, but they've given up so much ground. He's going to go back to the site. This will be two players stacked in the same angle. That actually may work. Because Flush are getting Smith, they're going to put focus on him at Hut. The second player doesn't need to peek. He may not even need to do anything because Flush is getting all the kills. It's down the screen, one versus three, and he's gone, Flush again. Four kills, why not? No one inside of Checkers right now from G2. They're both inside the back of the site. It's Scream to find Flush at first, though. It's starting off so well and bodied on Dennis again. So efficient in this B site, but RPK goes down. Given over commitment trying to jump up on the boxes to see above the smoke, and it's followed up by Venton on the shots, but not before he found JW, so it's still a three versus two. He's doing what he can. Two players on headshot as they try and get the bomb into a better position. They line it up and Venton's easily got down Smith's in body. Now finally a round that could be theirs, but Scream has 36 HP. They're not even making it uncomfortable for this like the terrorists. They're waiting for them to plant, surely. Then it's all run in and line up for them. Still, two on one. Scream in towards heaven. 
Hoping that he'll be gifted the same sort of levels of uh, ease there. Gets the first and the second yeah. as well. This could be a third get. Going to try a nice shot back. Hold it because the pre-fire came out. And Shox does go down, but you're right. They didn't even check it. They didn't even consider it. And it's again where Shox gets into an aggressive position to take back space in the round. It's now a two versus two. And Dennis Edmund is his last name. With one HP, is going to try and clear off some space to allow the bomb to cross over. But there's no smoke inside of the site. It's too easy for Smith. Lined up with the AWP. Flank coming in. RPK was spotted. Dennis knows this, so he has to be careful because one good headshot could do it. Brings it back to the one-on-one, -on -one, and now it's against the AWP. A missed shot's the opportunity, and they don't know that Dennis is on 1HP because Smith is sticking on the AWP. Thankfully, goes to the oh. pistol. Nearly lands it through the smoke. Bomb's going to go down. And this is still anyone's game, despite that he has 1HP. He could clutch this out. Good crosshair placement, good positioning. Oh. Nearly finds the headshot as well. Smith goes to 47, and back inside of the smoke. Smith, he does get the AWP out, and Dennis has 1HP, and he clutches it out.